You know who else I saw out there? He looks amazing as they say. Dick Clark. Can you believe this guy? Oh, my God. Um, he's very bitter sometimes. Very, very angry man at times. It comes from having lived over 400 years. <laughs> See, he's seen so many people die, it's pathetic. I mean, he, he started in the business in 1585 with the Basil Bandstand. He, he peddled Gregorian chants to uh, various monasteries. You know. How about that, brother? Huh? Six for beat, four for lyrics. I give him credit for one thing. All the kids dancing were white, but on that American bandstand, we had the great black rock and roll artist first time. 1955, you have to understand, what were we listening to music-wise? Pat Boone? The music was terrible! Suddenly, there's little Richard doing Tutti Frutti. wa ba blue ba la bamboo Tutti Frutti! Whoa, man! We went up to the Apollo to see him, and uh, he was fantastic in person, and some idiot yelled from the balcony, Hey, you faggot! He goes, Oh, you wish you could! I mean, he was... <laughs> He's lightning in a bottle this second. Anyway, it nerved my father, you know. Wah-bah-ba-loo-bah. <laughs> what is it? What kind of stupid lyric? You know, Pat Boone made a cover record of it. Sold five times as many. That was America, 1955. A little less funky. wah ba ba loo ba ba la bamboo tutti fruity wah ba loo tutti fruity wah ba loo You gotta rock, 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 and roll, roll, roll. Funky rock and roll, funky roll. If you're gonna rock, you have to roll too. Anyway. He was a magnificent, he still is a magnificent performer, but it nerved my father. We were popping in. Tootie Fruity, what is that? What kind of stupid lyric is that, you know? And I, it was a, a sexual double entendre. I didn't have the sophistication at 13 to tell my father that. It was a sexual double entendre, like those old race records in the 20s. I'm looking for a hot dog for my roll. You know, you know I want it hot, don't want it cold. You know. Baby, put your car in my garage. Ba, 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 ba. I'm not talking about architecture here, sir. Sigmund Freud, how are you? So my father is, is vexed by this. He goes, uh, you know, what is this? What is this? This tutti frutti. What is this? A code word with you kids? <laughs> I said, yes, pop. It's a code word, right? Billy, tutti frutti. Harold, tutti frutti. <laughs> Willie, tutti frutti. Teenage signal. Kill parents in their sleep tonight. Tutti frutti. <laughs> and fruity tutti. Over and out. All right, times have changed. Three years ago, my kid is 13. I peek in on him. He's looking at MTV, he's watching the Red Hot Chili Peppers video, which they're dressed in uh, saran wrap in a desert and leering at the camera. You know. <laughs> Singing their number one hit, Give It Away. What I got you gotta give it to your mother. What I got you gotta take a stick it in, yo. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. I must say, I was shocked. This was a single on Dond. <laughs> I was shocked. I got my bearings here, you know what I mean? The sight of my little rosy cheeked boy standing in front of the set mimicking. Well, I got you, God, I'll give it to you. I was hip. I didn't want to be unhip like my father. I was casual about it. Uh, hey, man, can we talk? <laughs> Let me ask you this. Um, what kind of stupid lyric is that? Give what away to whose mother? Stick what and who? Give what away to who? What kind of way is that to talk about someone's mother? What is this, a code word with you? A man who begins to sound exactly like his father in the twilight zone. Pat Boone made a cover of Give It Away. It didn't sell too much. In, uh, <laughs> in his new leather outfit, you know what I've got? You've got to give it to your mother. All your love. 
in her heart. Take all your love and stick it in your mother's heart. Give it away, give it away, all your love. Give it away, give it away. And you will have a very happy day. Give it away. 